Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I'm going to talk about some of the best things I know, eyeshadow palettes. And when it's coming like to the end of the year, there is something that I really love with it. And it's not Christmas and everything, it is throwbacks. And I love to like look back at the year and also look back at the year before. So today I am going to see if I still love the palettes that I have as favorites for 2019. And they are coming some more of these throwbacks. I think I want to do them and I hope that you want to see them. But today I am starting with eyeshadows because eyeshadows is the love of my life. That was, that was serious. So I have taken the palettes that I had as favorites from 2019 and I only think it was these. Yes. And I'm going to tell you if I still love them. So the first one I talked about was not a palette, but it was eyeshadows from Lethal. And if you still wonder, do I love Lethal? Yes, I do. I have four palettes, so I have three where I have taken the shades. Okay, this isn't full. Where the hell have I put my shadows? I think they might be here. I really hope. This was a fail. Yeah, here I have more. So, I have... Are these, are these getting like one? Yeah. So I have these. Maybe I should put them in together. I don't, I'm not going to do that today because I'm so well prepared. And I also have these. These I actually haven't used any of them yet. Bad of me. So I have these. I also got the uh, this palette. Can't remember the name of it. After Dark, yeah. <laughs> the After Dark. And the last shades I bought and put together my own is, are these. And Lethal is still one of my favorites when it comes to eyeshadows. I am planning on doing, take all my Lethal shades in a big empty palette and do a palette bingo. And maybe like palette of the month with my singles from Lethal. But yeah, I still love them. So some of my favorites. They have such an amazing formula and the colors are the best. Then another brand is Kaleidos and as you may know I love Kaleidos. I have Kaleidos on my eyes right now. I have used the escape pod. I did a face off. I can leave it up here. But the palette that I had as a favorite last year was the Vier Neon. This palette is unfortunately discontinued. I don't know why. I love this palette. This is still I think my favorite or at least top two from Kaleidos. I still love this. This is an amazing palette. And it's just this. I don't miss anything with it. And I don't want to change anything. So I still love this. So happy that I have it. I got this in PR. Super thankful for that. I love it. Then I also talked about a US Place palette. And this US Place palette. I think it still is my favorite. It is... Yeah, this has to be my favorite from Yves Place. It's the Tri Palette. And do you know what? This is also discontinued. And if we look at it, we can all ask ourselves, what were you thinking, Yves Place? Because this is gorgeous. I love this. This was like... <sighs> the green I fell in love with. And I still love this palette. It is my favorite palette from US Place still. I love this from the start. It's just an amazing palette and I don't know why they are discontinuing this. I don't know if it is because they want to make room for other palettes, but like discontinue the Dusay palette, nobody would even care. And the last two palettes and brand that was new to me in 2019 is Ace Boutet. 
and I talked about the flare palette. It looks like this. I really, really like this palette. I don't have any problems with the formula at all. I have used this quite a lot for me. I have done first impression, free looks one palette. I have used this like in Get Ready With Me's and I have used it outside of YouTube on my own. I really like this palette. I think it has fun color story and it has so much and you can do so so much with this. I still really really love this. I don't use it that much now but I used some of the colors. I did a monochromatic orange look. I used some of the colors. It is really amazing and I don't know what people say when they say they don't like this. I, I don't get it. And this is going really fast. <laughs> Maybe because I think I've had really long videos. So the last palette that is also from Ace Bouté is the Oceanic palette. And it feels like with this palette. I talk about this a lot. Like how much I love it. And it is my favorite green and blue palette. But then when I like search on my channel. I haven't done that much with this. And actually filmed it. I did... Have I done? I know I have done palette bingo together with Jessica, and I also used it in a Get Ready with Me or Get Ready with Us that I did with Jessica, and I did a first impression. But more than that, I don't think I filmed with this. I have used it though, but I don't think I filmed with it anymore. Maybe I should do a free looks one palette with this one, or have I done it? I don't think so. Do you want to see that? I don't know, but I want to play with it. And yeah, I still really like this one. And I think the formula is really good. And this shade is amazing. I still love it to death. So yeah, the Oceanic palette. I love it really much. I don't, I talk about it really much, but I like never use it. So I want to use you. Maybe I should do an Ace Bouté week. I think I will do that. And maybe a free looks one palette with that. I think so. And yeah, that was actually all the palettes I had as favorites as, as of last year. Still love all of them. And yeah, it is going to be so hard to like pick my favorite palettes for this year. But in December it is coming like my favorite base products, my favorite lip products skincare and eyeshadows i might just start to think about it now already so i will be done in december i might do that and i think i have something that's itching on my nose so yeah i really hope you like this video and i hope that you are looking forward to throwbacks because they are coming just be aware that is my favorite thing about december and i love to watch them and i love to do them so you just have to hang in there because they are coming, even if you want, don't want it. Okay, I'm going to stop talk now and I really hope that you liked this video. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos. And I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!